Hello. Hello. Welcome to Orphan Espresso. I'm Doug. I'm Barb. And uh, we're here to demonstrate our new OE third shot heat sink for the small group lever espresso machines. Uh, Olympia Cremina, La Pavoni, Europe Acola, Professional, Electra MCAL can be adapted to many of the small group machines. It fits both the Millennium, the Pavoni Millennium and Premillennium. Uh, it's made out of aluminum and so if you do need to adapt the ears to make it fit into your particular machine, it's quite easy to do with the file, nice soft filing, easy to do. Well, this demonstration is to show how this works and that it does work. Uh, this machine, if you can you see the temperature there in the yes. finder? Okay. This machine has been sitting for oh, about 45 minutes while we did some other things and the temperature, I have a thermocouple probe that's taped to the side of the group. This is not precise but we're just getting some relative readings here. Uh, the temperature is stabilizing but it slowly increases and I know on this particular machine if I were to leave this alone for four or five hours the group would slowly increase in temperature to about 194 degrees and then it just fluctuates when the pressure stat turns on and off uh, but in this case over the last 10 minutes while we've been getting set up it's gone from about 182 to let's see it's it's just will slowly slowly go up until it reaches a temper that temperature that it's too hot to pull a shot with. So uh, let's just boost this artificially as we start out with our experiment. I'll go ahead and I'll flush the group and you see what happens when the boiler water enters the group. You get an immediate spike in temperature. It's gone off the scale of this particular meter so that means it's over 200 degrees now. That's the temperature of the group the outside temperature of the group and it will slowly drop back down uh, eventually below 200 so we can start seeing some reasonable readings again but let's just say that you want to reduce the temperature of the group because you say it's too hot to pull a shot well there's various ways see now we're slowly it slowly comes back down what's happening now is the heat is being dissipated from the group into the air and this will settle in from my experience this will settle in at about 194 degrees on this particular machine now as you see it slowly comes back down so at this point let's say we want to boost this process and this is why we developed the Orphan Espresso third shot the idea is to extend the range of your machine uh, without making your gaskets, without uh, using cold cloths, without uh, any of these nothing various things. Nothing invasive and nothing messy. Nothing invasive. You don't have to change anything on the machine. Uh, basically, it works on the, on the principle of heat sink. This is almost eight ounces of solid aluminum. It's machined to fit in the group simply. We have a silicone band. Whoops. <laughs> up, 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 up there. Have a silicone band around uh, so it doesn't get too hot to your fingers. Now, if you put this in, move my arm where you want it. Right there. Right there. If you put this in, it's like QBC, isn't it? It is. No, I've, Except you're better at it. You were better. If you leave this in for a long time, it gets too hot to touch. But that's a really long time because the effect that we want is immediate and we want this to draw heat from the group while we're doing our coffee routine. Now we're down to 196, so let's just go ahead. I take it and I lock it in. I lock in and start the timer. And I didn't get the timer started, so there we go. Now, we'll just watch the numbers. You'll see not a lot in the very beginning. The, the third shot was at room temperature, sitting here, or 72 by the thermometer that I have. But you see, it, it begins to take off.
from experience. And you'll still be, where did we start? 196, was it? Something I think like so. That? So we've got a five temperature, five degree temperature drop now. We're coming up on a minute. Yes, on a minute. Six degrees on a minute. And we found that if you rinse the heat sink in cold water, just run under tap water and dry it off, this first minute it draws more heat out. It's much more rapid because of the differential between the temperature of the heat sink and the temperature of the group. So at a minute we got about six degrees lowering. Yes. And during this period of time, of course, you'd be drying out your portafilter and, and taking care of your cups and grinding your coffee and, and tamping and time flies when you're having fun, but it kind of goes slow when you're watching a meter. That's true. <laughs> so we started at 196. We've generally seen that we get from a room temperature third shot, we get about a 10 degree drop. As I said, the colder it is, the more drop you get. But the interesting thing, now we're at two minutes, nine two, at, the interesting thing is, is that it starts to bottom out and that we've left this in for five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes, and we've seen a about a 12, 12 and a half degree uh, uh, temperature drop in the group temp, but it, it, because the, the two temperatures begin to normalize, the, the, the range between the two gets smaller, the rate of, of heat exchange slows down. And uh, uh, it, it, it seems to have a theoretical maximum before it turns around, stabilizes, and then will begin to heat up again normally, just like it's part of the group. So, at three minutes, we've done 12 degrees, and it will stay at about 12 degrees. Interestingly enough, when you take off your, your third shot, you seem to have a, a fairly high de degree of stability of the temperature of the group. It's now, it's in this zone where it, it's beginning to take on heat, but you see there's a lag period. It's, it's nice and stable during this period of time. You don't have to rush to it uh, to get back. And so we're now down into a, a pretty good temperature for, for, for pulling a shot once again after that peak from the flushing. The same thing would be true when you pull a shot. Rinse it in cold water, pull your shot, take out your portafilter. If you're going for an immediate one, put it in cold. Five about five degree drop per minute, maximum about 12 degrees, and you're good to go again. So, that's the, the who are you going to believe, me or your lion eyes? So there you are. Uh, that's our, our time test, uh, sucking, and it's all in there. There's 12 degrees of group warm. heat. There's 12 degrees in that little block of, of aluminum, and you're good to go. That's the OE third shot. Um, hope it works for you as well as it works for us.